The word for today, written by Bob and Debbie Gass. Your words reveal your heart. The words you speak will give you away every time. It happened to Peter. On the night Jesus was arrested and all his disciples scattered, Peter stayed close enough to see what was happening, but not close enough to be identified with him. The Bible says, Those who stood by came up and said to Peter, Surely you are also one of them, for your speech betrays you. Then he began to curse and swear, saying, I do not know the man. Immediately the rooster crowed. And Peter remembered the word of Jesus who had said to him, Before the rooster crows, you will deny me three times. So he went out and wept bitterly. Matthew 26, 73-75 after that episode, nobody accused Peter of being a follower of Jesus. Isn't it interesting how profanity in any language has a way of making others question the quality of your relationship with Christ? Your words have the power to build people up or tear them down, draw them to Christ or drive them away. With that in mind, here are two scriptures you need to underscore and think about often. One. Let your speech always be with grace, that you may know how you ought to answer each other. Colossians 4 verse 6 2. Do not let any unwholesome talk come out of your mouths, but only what is helpful for building others up, that it may benefit those who listen. Ephesians 4 29 Today, here's a prayer for you to pray. Father, may the words I speak this day Bring credit to the name of Jesus and draw others close to him. In his name I pray. Amen.